Did you know there are about 1 million same-sex couple households in the United States and only half of them are married? I wonder why this is. Today my purpose is to persuade you to support marriage equality. Marriage equality is something I have spent time researching and feel I know enough to inform you on the topic. Marriage equality is something relatively new to people and is a debate with many opinions. However, everyone deserves the opportunity of marriage and happiness. And by choosing to support marriage equality, you are allowing this for other people. After hearing what I'll say today on the topic, I think you will agree to support marriage equality. With this in mind, I will begin with the problem, then explain some of its causes, and finally, offer my solution. With our roadmap in place, let's begin with the problem. The problem is, some people do not support marriage equality. For example, a survey done on same-sex marriage division indicates there is almost an equal divide between people who support marriage equality compared to those who don't. According to PRRI, a website who writes articles on many big research topics, an article shares a survey done on people to share how they feel about marriage equality, written on February 26, 2019. In this article it shares, 22% of people strongly favor marriage equality compared to 20% of people strongly oppose, and 56% of people fall within the middle. Another example is, in certain states, it can be seen as they overall do not support marriage equality. In fact, 10 states strongly oppose of it. According to the Movement Advancement Project, who writes many articles related to marriage equality, shared this survey that began in March of 2006 and has its last update on May 19th of 2023. Together, these two examples show there is a high majority of people that still oppose marriage equality. With the problem in mind, let's examine some of its causes. There are two primary reasons people oppose marriage equality. The first reason comes from believing it is not traditional, or as some may say, not the correct way to get married. According to a US UCLA newsroom article published on February 26 of 2016, written by David Pinsoff, who is a UCLA graduate student of philosophy, and the lead author of the study of why people said they oppose marriage equality. After gathering research to why people said they oppose marriage equality, one of the main reasons was people view the idea of same-sex marriage as undermining the institution of a traditional marriage. However, many people can be seen as much happier when they are allowed the right to marry who they love, even if it is not what has been seen as traditional. According to NPR News Who Reports on America's Big Updates, author Bill Chapel wrote on June 26 of 2015, right after marriage equality was reported legal in all 50 states, as same-sex couples finally felt happiness of getting what they have been fighting for, that our love is now equal, and the Supreme Court writes, equal justice under law applies to marriage equality as well. The second reason comes from believing it violates their religious beliefs. According to Pew Research Center, who has been writing articles on big debatable subjects since 2004, shares a data table that is up to date showing people with certain religions strongly opposed of marriage equality, compared to those who said they had no religious beliefs. However, many people with religions that do not support marriage equality say that just because their religion does not support it and they themselves would never have a same-sex marriage does not mean they'll not support someone else. According to Human Rights Campaign, who fights for equality for members of the LGBTQ family, writes in June of 2020 that a growing number of organized religious groups have issued statements welcoming LGBTQ family and extending marriage rights to them. With the problem and causes in mind, let's turn to my solution. My solution to support marriage equality offers two primary benefits. The first benefit is to lead to everyone being happier with their life and feeling supported by their decisions and marriage. According to PubMed Central article published on June 20th of 20, 2018 by Angie Wuton, who works for the Department of Medicine at San Francisco University, interviewed people a part of same-sex marriages and adhered to their feeling of being accepted when it comes to marriage equality. People shared they felt included in society and a greater acceptance of their identity. The second benefit is helping people not feel afraid to show who they are. 
According to Human Rights Watch article published on December 7th of 2016 about discrimination towards young LGBTQ members, written by a young boy, Josh Greer, who has experienced firsthandly how you can feel scared to show who you truly are. Josh shares how growing up being bullied and seeing how marriage equality was not supported by most people made him feel scared to show who he was. In conclusion, supporting marriage equality is important. Let's review what we've learned today. First, we learned the problem is many people do not support marriage equality, that only half of the country still opposes marriage equality, as well as certain states in the country have very strong feelings compared to others. Next, we learned two reasons to why people oppose marriage equality. That marriage equality is not a traditional marriage that people approve of, as well as it violates their religious beliefs. However, we learned people who are allowed marriage equality are much happier that they are allowed the right to marriage. We also learned people with religious beliefs can still support people involved in marriage equality. Finally, we learned my solution to support marriage equality offers two significant benefits, which include leading everyone to be happier in life as well as helping people not feel afraid to show who they are. Altogether, people may have their reasons for not supporting marriage equality, but as we can see, Coming together to support this group of people makes them feel equal and accepted. Overall in life, everyone wants to feel equal and accepted and be allowed to have the same rights as everyone else. This means no one should be left out or not supported for choosing to live their life and be able to get married to who they love the way anyone else would be able to. This is why I am asking you to support marriage equality, to make everyone feel equal and accepted and more important, to be able to marry who you choose.